what's up everybody for the Winitachi you know what it is and what's goody I just want to start off the vlog by saying thank you very much for tuning in if you guys got any comments feedback questions go ahead and post in the comment section down below if you guys got any suggestions on what you want to see future wise on the channel so go ahead and post down below as well in the comment section don't forget to check out the description box where we do our monthly giveaways there and as well as other giveaways we do have a Pokemon nearby and it is a Clefairy so we're gonna go ahead and catch this one it is a 406 um, I have gone ahead and uh, I haven't been playing Pokemon Go in a while actually. Uh, gone out vlogging and um, capturing. I haven't done that in a while. But today we are back at it again at the park. And uh, we are about to capture this guy right here. But first of all we're going to make our way over to this Pokestop. And we're going to go ahead and do the circle walk as we always do. If you guys want to go ahead and make sure you guys see that one out. Go ahead and check out one of our earlier vlogs where we actually did the whole entire thing. This time I'm just going to go ahead and walk around, hatch these eggs as much as possible, as quickly as possible. We only have, oh wow, how did that not capture? Oh no, I'm struggling over here guys, I don't even need this one. Ah, oh, goddamn, here we go. What, what, a, what a way to start this one off. I do have the ability to evolve a Nidorino into a Nido King, but I'm hopefully I can get another enough candies to evolve a good Nidoran. Or, I do have a good Nidorino, let's put it that way, I just want an extra Nidorino just in case. Um, so we're going to go ahead and make sure we can capture a Nidorino before we go ahead and evolve uh, that my current Nidorino. I highly doubt I'm going to find one, a Nidorino that's better than the current one I have. And I'm also going to go ahead and show you before we go ahead and close off this intro, I know it's a longer than usual intro, uh, what eggs that we have to ha uh, hatch. Uh, we do have a bunch of, there's goddamn bugs everywhere. Uh, as you guys can see, first of all, um, I have gone ahead and organized all of my Pokemon. Bulbasaur has a star, Charmander has a star, Squirtle has a star. The Pokemons with stars are the ones that I want to evolve into Max. So this Charmeleon, I'm not going to evolve to Max. I'm going to end up getting this Charmander up into a Charizard. Um, whichever, which Pokemon are stronger are the ones that I want at Max. So this Beedrill is my strongest uh, one that I'm going to get. The Weedle and the Kakuna that I currently have are never going to be as strong as this Beedrill. And this Beedrill is currently iv stronger. I've gone ahead and gone through everything. This Pidgeot is a goddamn pro. So I'm never going to go ahead and change that. Same with the Raticate. But as you guys can see in the beginning, I do have a Caterpie that's better than the Metapod. So I'm going to want to get a couple more ca uh, candies before I get a Butterfree. And uh, so on and so forth. So I've gone ahead and organized my Pokemon. Um, but I do have three eggs that are currently in the process. They're all 5k eggs. And then we got three 10k eggs. So hopefully we can get some more 10k eggs so we can get that video out soon. Uh, hopefully it's within this next month. And uh, I just want to say, first of all again, thank you very much for tuning in. And let's go ahead and just start walking around the park gathering all of these pokey stops and if we find if we really need to uh, we'll go ahead and go to another place but hopefully we can get this pony top because i know i'm very close to being able to evolve that as well so again i'm just going to go ahead and walk around this park by myself uh really nothing else to do and um yeah hit the pokey stops get some eggs hatch some eggs and i'll bring you guys back for the egg hatching again we are still aiming for porygon from the 5k we do also need Licky Ton from the 5Ks, and then for the 10Ks, which I'm going to save up for, we're going to need Lapras and Chansey out of those. Uh, out of those. So, again, we're still aiming for Porygon. So, Porygon, wherever you at, come holler at me. I'm ready to capture you and add you to the squad. All right, everybody. Just as I was talking about earlier, out of the 10K eggs, I know there's a car coming behind me. Out of the 10K eggs. Uh, we needed the Chansey and a Lapras, correct? Now look at my nearby. The first time I've actually, no. Not the, well, first time I've actually seen a Chansey on my nearby. But when Pokevision was live, I was able to see Chansey through Pokevision near my house. But I was never able to get to it. Hopefully, we can find this one. And that would be a great capture of the night in a great way. Ooh, 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 ooh. Can I take this? Can I take this? Come on, come on, come on. Load, oh, uh, CP, 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 CP. I always got to be ready. I always got to be prepared. Oh, let's just throw him in there. Let's just throw him in there. Oh, I didn't get it. Didn't get it. All right, Mystic took it. Mystic Squad took it. Let's see what type of uh, Pokemon A ended up dropping in an RK9 as well. Oh well, congratulations to Mystic for taking over that gym. Sadly, I can't take it. But again, hopefully we can find this Chansey because this is going to be a beast of a capture tonight. I know Chansey is not great CP-wise and fighting-wise, but it is a tank and it is from the 10k legendaries. So let's go ahead and find this Chansey. We're going to be walking everywhere for this one, son. Alrighty, we ended up finding this Chansey. You guys know I'm putting everything on the paint. Oh, CP is so bad, but uh, we got to throw everything on this. We're throwing raspberries, we're throwing ultra balls, we're throwing everything at this thing, son. We got to be able to capture this so I don't have to worry about getting it in an egg. Oh my gosh, we're throwing ultra balls all at this thing. It is so big. It is so big you can't miss. That's 
That's what she said. So big you can't miss, son. Come on, let's get to Chansey. First try, first try. You guys know we're adding it up to the Pokedex right now, son. Adding it into the Pokedex. Look at that, look at that. We have just added a brand new Pokemon to the Pokedex and I got so many more that I can evolve that are gonna be coming in pretty damn soon. That 337 though, uh, roughly about 95% on the CP scale. Um, we got both extra small, Zen Head, Butt Sidekick, it really doesn't really matter because it's not a fighting type Pokemon anyways. But uh, Pokedex wise, let's go ahead and check it out. The countdown, we've got 114 Pokemon caught, captured out of 142 that we can actually capture within uh, America right now. So let's go ahead and keep traveling around and get some more Pokestops as well as some eggs. And I ended up taking this gym over as well. Uh, a couple of other guys were fighting it over. They got a 368 Ponyta, a Gloom, and then my 1974 RK9 is just holding it down right now. Holding it down. Uh, we got eggs hatching already. I was just saying bye to these guys over here. We got eggs hatching already. Come on. Oh my god. Oh, wow. Hey, whoa, 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 whoa. Time out. High CP, please. That ain't bad. That ain't bad. I'll take it. 613 CP. Uh, we got 70 candies. We're going to go ahead and check it out based off of uh, my other Psyduck as well. I believe that one was better than the current Psyduck. Let's go ahead and check it out right now because we're really not doing that too much just in this vlog right now. So we're going to go ahead and check it out. Uh, we're going to do number right now. Go ahead and number this up. And go ahead and check out the Golduck and the Psyduck. The brand new Psyduck that I just got, I believe, is still not as good. They're, are, they're complaining about my RK9 right now. <laughs> uh, the 613 Psyduck, all right, so it's a 613 Psyduck, and how much is the CP? Roughly about 80-ish percent, and this Golduck is, ooh, it's better. Oh, we going for it. We going for it right now, son. We going for it, mate. We are gonna evolve. We gon' evolution this Psyduck. I do not find any Psyducks in the locations that I am. Uh, unless I go to Santa Monica, uh, which is the closest water, well, not really the closest water, but I mean, there's really no Psyducks near me, so it's very hard for me to get a Psyduck unless it's in an egg. Got my second Gold Duck. This is a boss and a half. It's gotta be stronger than the current Gold Duck that I have right now. Uh, let's go ahead and check them out. Check them out, CP wise, over 13. Over 13. Ooh, it was so close to being leet. Three off from being leet. Oh my gosh, not too bad though, not too bad. Let's go ahead and star this bad boy. Give him a star, gotta make sure he's never gonna be deleted. Uh, confusion and Psychic. And then what is this one though? I gotta, I gotta figure one out. Um, he's Confusion and Ice Beam. I'm gonna get rid of this one. We don't really need him. Get rid of the, there we go. All right, so we got a brand new Golduck that got added to the squad right now. We've got that Chansey that got added to the squad. we got so much that's going great right now. And we do got my RK9 in the gym. So we're going to go ahead and keep basically hatching eggs, getting Pokestops, and hopefully we can get some more new Pokemon because I'm very stoked about getting that Chansey today. We are doing great. We ended up finding a Ponyta, which should be the last one that I need for a Rapidash. So this should be going great. I'm only going to use a Pokeball because the CP on this one's not too high at all. Um, but hopefully we can capture this one and then we'll be able to get a brand new Pokemon added to the Pokedex again. And that is going to be a Rapidash. And we did get it on the first try, so that was very, very good. We didn't have to waste any Ultra Balls or anything on that. We got a, somehow we got a Curveball on that. 52 candies, perfect. Um, we are going to go ahead and dig right on in. Dig, oh, dive on in. We're going to dive on in. And then we're going to go ahead and look at our Ponytas, Ponytas. I believe we have three right now, but one's at the 800 mark. And it is going to be our first Ponyta turning into a Rapidash, so it will be our first one that will be golden. Let's go ahead and uh, get this ev evolution in. The CP bar is just roughly 85-ish percent. Not not too high at all, not too high at all. But finally we're gonna be able to finish this up. Almost done, almost done with the Pokedex. Lols, we're nowhere near done with the Pokedex, guys. We are nowhere near done. But this is our very first Rapidash, and hopefully the CP is high. I really have no clue what the CP on a Rapidash is going to be. Um, hopefully it's above 1,500. No, it's at 1,227. That is not bad at all. Uh, damn, what the hell is going on with this? I'm getting extra smalls left and right. This game's trying to tell me something, man. This game's trying to tell me something. Uh, let's just go ahead and get rid of the 400 uh, Ponyta, and uh, we'll go from there. Hopefully we can get a Nidorino today. And then we'll be able to go ahead and evolve one of those as well. But I do have to check something out. Uh, recently, I just caught a... Oh my gosh, you got to go all the way back up. I wish it just goes back up to the beginning anyways, because I'm looking at recent. I uh, just caught an Ekans, so I need to go ahead and check that out as well. Go ahead and go to number. 
and uh, check out what my Ekans were. The Ekans that I just caught wasn't good. Okay, the Ekans that I have as well are the 257 Ekans. I only have 39 candy, but that one's not good as well. My Arbok, on the other hand, is really good. So let's go ahead and transfer this bad boy. We got 40 candies right now. Hopefully we can find a cool Ekans, but I really doubt it because this Arbok is like 99% complete on his uh, CP chart for me. Uh, but for now, let's go ahead and keep capturing Pokemon. We are going to get this Paris out of the way, and then we're going to go ahead and continue with the vlog, hatching eggs as well as getting Pokestops. So I will see you guys during the next egg, and that's something else cool pops up. I ask for better timing. It is another 5K. We're about to head over to the back of the park anyways right now. It is a polywag, which isn't too bad, but we are just walking out of in the middle of nowhere right now. Uh, I was just over here catching a Rhyhorn because I accidentally deleted my Rhydon, but I only needed one more Rhyhorn anyways in order to get a better Rhydon, so that's what I was actually aiming for. So I finally got my Rhydon back, but uh, we got a, we got 16 candies, 436 Poliwag. Gonna go ahead and check out what the deal with that one is right now. But uh, we're gonna go ahead and head on over to the back of the park, which is behind me. But first, I can actually go ahead and hit this Pokestop up really quick because I was just there chilling for a while looking through my Pokemon and it's already reset. So I'm going to go ahead and head on back and we'll go ahead and head on back to the back of the park anyways to see if there's any interesting Pokemon over there. But let's go ahead and continue with it. Alright, just a quick one here. As you guys can see, we got another 5k. No, wait, this is the 2k egg popping. Give me a starter sun into Caterpie. Actually, I'll take it. Give me 12 candies. Give me a lot of candies because we can evolve into a Butterfree right now. 55. We do need 62 because we are going to be evolving one of our uh, Caterpies into a Butterfree, uh, into a Metapod and into a Butterfree. So, sadly, we just got that one out of a 2k but that gives us more opportunities to get more eggs uh, we do got a 224 caterpie uh, which is a little bit better than this metapod but we're going to go ahead and do so uh, but one thing i do want to say is we do now have 10 four 10k eggs so hopefully we can get a another 10k before we end off tonight and our next egg to hatch is going to be that 4.2 uh, 5k egg so let's stay with me until then hopefully it hatches before we leave tonight all right now i just caught myself an ekans and i thought it was gonna be trash but it ain't trash so we got a 475 ekans and it is a little bit higher on the cp than the 1016 i hope it is extra large as well so hopefully it can continue with the extra large traits and if this is the way we're gonna end off the vlog i am very happy with this week we have upgraded a lot of our evolutions into higher cp mons we've caught chancy we've got rapid ash we've got plenty of new mons into the squad and uh, we got a brand new arbok as well so let's go ahead and see the cp on this one hopefully it is higher than my other one it is at 1052 and i told you before in the beginning of the vlog there wasn't going to be many that could outdo this 1016 arbok but i found out a way and i do want to go ahead and check one more thing while we do that did it keep its XL stat and it went to extra small. So Niantic, what are you doing to me, son? Everything went extra small today. Don't know what's going on with my luck, but that's okay. We're gonna go ahead and continue our walk, continue our journey. We have 6% battery left on this phone, but I do have another phone that has 50% battery. I was not able to charge that other phone because I was using it for business reasons. Um, but we're gonna go ahead and continue our journey. Um, as you, what's even funny is Journey's playing in the goddamn background right now, son. So we're gonna continue our journey through this park, hit the Pokestop, see if we can catch some more cool Pokemon. Right now there's only an Onyx on our uh, radar. But um, yeah, let's continue with it. And if it is the end of the vlog, thank you very much for tuning in. If not, I will continue to see you guys in just a little bit. That's not bad. You don't got it? Oh. Crap. No way. I got a raspberry this. Dang, my raspberry and green one. The CP's so bad though. What's yours? 231. No, stupid. I hate when it does that. It flings the ball super far. Uh -huh. For no reason. Yes. What was yours? 370. Oof. Not bad. Mine oh no, I can't get it. I used a great ball and a raspberry. Okay, okay, okay. I'm using ultra balls right now. I don't, I'm about to get those. What was your CP? <laughs> All right, come on. I have 15. What is life? 15 candies? I'm getting rid of like some of them. Oh, Whatever, come on. I want to charm. I just need this for the candies. One of my charm manders is XL twice. Yes, thank you. Got it. 
Got it. Okay, I got it. And Easy. I'm transferring some. One Pokeball. I got 30 candies. What was but yours? I have 19 now. I need like one more or two more. Two more, yeah. You can. I am going to remove my Charmeleon, sadly. Yes, I'm glad we caught him. And there was a Squirtle near earlier. There was a Squirtle here? Yeah, over there. Oh wow, I didn't capture it. I need it. everything. I'm going to evolve my double XL Charmander that was 370 into a Charmeleon. Oh, you got your 371 too? I got a 371 yeah. and I'd like to evolve this one, so. My Charmeleon sucks. Hopefully the CP is high. It's only a What's your highest Charmeleon that you've ever had? I got rid of it, it was at like 200 and something. So. Did you find it or did you? I, I, I found it. 623, not bad, the CP's bar went. A 4.7? Mm -hmm. All right, finally, the last egg. It's the last egg I'm hatching today though. So hopefully we can get this in. Please, oh my, are you joking? Are you joking? <laughs> I don't, we, we catch too many of these. I know, and the R box aren't even it. worth it. Like, I know, we, we just found an R box and we I didn't even bother capturing it. I, that was pathetic. 